Hello everyone, my name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Sorry. Hmm? What's this? No, oh, it's a slime. Genesis 42 to 45. Joseph's, sorry, Joseph's brother were not good to him. They did bad things because of, of them. Joseph had hard times in Egypt. But God was with Joseph. God helped him. God gave Joseph wisdom. God made him a ruler of Egypt. Joseph forgave his brothers. So, sorry. Sorry, something happens. So, Joseph, I think Joseph has met his brother. Because Joseph forgave his brothers. Joseph's brother hated Joseph and be not nice to Joseph and he they did bad things to Joseph but God made that good. As Joseph said they had seven good years with God's help. Joseph saved up crops. After that, seven bad years followed, but they had plenty of food in Egypt. So, as Joseph said, really the dream came true. With God's help, there were seven good years, there were lots of crops. So, Joseph saved the crops. After that, the seven bad years followed. And every world didn't have plenty of food. But Egypt had food. Plenty of food. With God's help. The brothers met the governor in the palace. They didn't know that Egyptian governor was Joseph. Joseph's brother wanted to buy some food. Joseph knew they were his brothers. Joseph said, you're the spies. You want to know how much food we have. The brother was shocked. They said in fear, no, we're here to buy food. So, Joseph's brother met the governor of Egypt and they also didn't know that Joseph was the governor and Joseph wanted to check that still Joseph's brother er doing like that so he was checking Joseph want to know if they still hate one other bring your youngest son brother youngest son brother next time and prove that you're not spies joseph saw they cared for benjamin he saw them helping one another to keep benjamin safe joseph wanted to ask them about his father and benjamin but he decided to not speak he gave enough food to food. He let them go there to the hometown. So 
they were like helping each other because that they knew the father like Benjamin. Brother hates brother were hating Joseph but now they knew that they have done wrong. Joseph's brother came to Egypt to buy fruit again. They didn't recognize G Joseph. Joseph couldn't help crying. Then he saw his brother again. Brothers, I am Joseph. The brother were scared. They thought that they should be killed. But Joseph said, it's all right. God sent me to Egypt before you. Let's live here in Egypt. Joseph forgave his brothers. They lived happily together. Chapter 9 Brave, Mar Brave Girl Miriam Exodus 2 Miriam was an Israel girl. Her family family lived in Egypt. The Pharaoh of Egypt didn't like the people of Israel. The Pharaoh ordered his men to kill all the Israel's baby boys. Miriam's mother had a lovely baby boy. She hid the baby and raised him. I will tell you why when Miriam the Israel were living in Egypt. Like in Joseph, Joseph has called his all brothers and the people also came. So they were in the Egypt. As the baby girl grew, she couldn't hide him any longer. She later saw it in the basket and placed it him in the river. I will be with baby, said Miram. Miram was a brave girl. Miram followed the basket carefully. So that baby was growing and grew and like his mother couldn't hide him and also they like mo his mother didn't want it to be killed baby to be killed so they have like put in the basket the baby cried in the basket. A woman came to the river and took a bath. She was the princess of Egypt. Look at this basket. She was surprised to see the baby in the basket. I will raise this cute baby myself. So the princess of Egypt has sawn the baby. And he decided to raise the baby herself. The princess said, I will call this baby Moses because I took him out of the water. Moses means a child out of the water. I need a nurse, word the princess. Miriam was watching everything. She ran to the princess and said, I know I'm a woman, she can help you. So Miriam, the princess nurse, and Miriam told that, I know a woman, she can help you. That should be his mother, right? My mother can take care of the baby said Miriam the princess said yes and Miriam brought her mother the princess asked her I will pay you 
for nursing this baby. The mother was very happy to raise her own baby openly. Thank you. You're such a brave girl, Miram, said the mother. Yesterday, I read the Bible story. And next time, I will read another good story. Then, let's see you next time. Bye!